Most energy in Israel comes from hydrocarbon fuels. The country's total primary energy demand is significantly higher than its total primary energy production, relying heavily on imports to meet its energy needs. Total primary energy consumption was 285.5 terawatt hours, 0.974 quad in 2011 or 24.5 mtoe, million ton of oil equivalent. Electricity consumption in Israel was 59.83 terawatt hours in 2014, while production was 64.44 terawatt hours with net export Ports of 4.94 terawatt hours. The installed generating capacity was about 16.25 gigawatts in the same year, almost all from hydrocarbon fuel plants, mostly coal and gas fueled. Renewable energy accounted for a minor share of electricity production, with a small photovoltaic installed capacity. However, there are a total of over 1.3 million solar water heaters installed as a result of mandatory solar water heating regulations. History Throughout Israel's history, securing the energy supply had been a major concern of Israeli policymakers. Today, Israel Electric Corporation, which traces its history to 1923, is the main electricity generator and distributor in Israel. Petroleum exploration began in 1947 on a surface feature in the Helots area in the southern coastal plain. The first discovery, Helots I, was completed in 1955, followed by the discovery and development of a few small wells in Kokov, Brewer, Ashdod and Zuck Tamror in 1957. The combined Helots Brewer Kokov field produced a total of 17.2 million barrels, a negligible amount compared with national consumption. Since the early 1950s, 480 oil and gas wells, land and offshore were drilled in Israel, most of which did not result in commercial success. In 1958–1961, several small gas fields were discovered in the southern Judean desert. From the Six-Day War until the Egyptian Separation Treaty in 1975, Israel produced large quantities of petroleum from the Abu Rhodes oil field in Sinai. In 1951, the Arab states accused American oil interests in Saudi Arabia of selling oil to Central American governments who circumvented the Arab blockade against Israel by selling the oil back to the refinery in Haifa. Topic: Primary energy. Topic: Natural gas. Since Israel's creation in 1948, it has been dependent on energy imports from other countries. Specifically, Israel produced 7 billion cubic meters of natural gas in 2013, and imported 720 million cubic meters in 2011. Historically, Israel has imported natural gas through the Arish Ashkelon pipeline from Egypt. Egypt is the second largest natural gas producer in North Africa. In 2005 Egypt signed a $2.5 billion deal to supply Israel with 57 billion cubic feet of gas per year for 15 years. Under this arrangement, Egypt supplies 40% of Israel's natural gas demand. The Israeli Electric Corporation IEC controls more than 95% of the electricity sector in Israel, and controls production, distribution, and transmission of electricity. 
The IEC has a natural gas distribution law which regulates the distribution of natural gas in Israel to empower market competition. The discoveries of the Tamar gas field in 2009 and the Leviathan gas field in 2010 off the coast of Israel were important. The natural gas reserves in these two fields Leviathan has around 19 trillion cubic feet could make Israel energy secure for more than 50 years. In 2013 Israel began commercial production of natural gas from the Tamar field. Energy Minister Yuval Steinitz said for many decades, the Arabs used the fact that they're supplying Europe with oil and natural gas in order to try to pressure Israel and now we will have something to balance and influence. Electricity <inaudible> 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 In 2015, energy consumption in Israel was 52.86 terawatt-hours, or 6,562 kilowatt-hours per capita. The Israel Electric Corporation (IEC) is the main producer of electricity in Israel, with a production capacity of 11,900 megawatts. In 2016, IEC's share of the electricity market was 71%. == Hydrocarbon fuels Most electricity in Israel comes from hydrocarbon fuels from the following IEC power plants. The following power plants belong to independent power producers and, although connected to the IEC's distribution grid, are not operated by the IEC. <inaudible> Renewable energy Renewable energy in Israel is produced in solar fields, such as Energix Renewable Energies Neo Hoviv and Katura Sun and from biogas 11 megawatts, hydroelectricity 6.6 megawatts and wind power in the Golan Heights wind farm 6 megawatts. Despite getting more than 300 days of sunshine per year, as of 2015, less than 2% of Israel's electricity comes from renewable sources. According to the Green Energy Association of Israel, the number of solar energy companies in the country has fallen from about 130 in 2010 to 60 in 2015. The association says that discoveries of large amounts of natural gas since 2009 have dimmed the government's interest in renewable energy. Officially, however, Israel maintains it will achieve its goal of 10% of its energy from renewable sources by 2020. Topic: <laughs> Nuclear energy. Although there is a fully functional heavy water nuclear reactor at Negev Nuclear Research Center, as of 2013 Israel has no nuclear power plants. However, in January 2007, Israeli Infrastructure Minister Benjamin Ben Eliezer said his country should consider producing nuclear power for civilian purposes. As a result of the nuclear emergencies at Japan's Fukushima I nuclear power plant, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu said on March 17, 2011, I don't think we're going to pursue civil nuclear energy in the coming years. topic solar water heating Israel is one of the world leaders in the use of solar thermal energy per capita 
As of the early 1990s, all new residential buildings were required by the government to install solar water heating systems, and Israel's National Infrastructure Ministry estimates that solar panels for water heating satisfy 4% of the country's total energy demand. Israel and Cyprus are the per capita leaders in the use of solar hot water systems with over 90% of homes using them. The Ministry of National Infrastructures estimates solar water heating saves Israel 2 million barrels cubic meters of oil a year. See also List of power stations in Israel